Hi, and welcome to Creating with Miss K. I have been tagged in It's Fall, y'all. Get to know me Q&A. I was tagged by YouTube sister Gigi Faison over at Gigi Faison for the love of decor. She loves decor, but this lady loves life, people, her family, and God. In my short time on YouTube, Gigi has embraced me and given me so much encouragement to say, you can do it. You're great, you're a creator. I don't know what profession she's in besides this YouTube, but she could definitely be a motivational coach. She's very passionate when it comes to her family and her love for God. I'm glad that we found each other. So please go by Gigi's channel and see all of the beautiful detailed tablescapes she does and the halls and just living her life. Now back to the fall Q&A. I want to thank Lady Cinnamon for hosting. She doesn't know this, but I actually call her the Lady Cinnamon. I've been so impressed with her. When we connected, I told my husband, that's Lady Cinnamon. Like, the Lady Cinnamon? I love her hauls, all of her DIYs. Just go by her channel and you'll see what I'm talking about. So, to the host, Lady Cinnamon, and her co-host, Gigi Faison, for the love of the core, here's my fall Q&A. Number one, favorite thing about autumn. I love the changing of the weather. I live in the South, so we don't need a lot of heat. We don't hardly need any air, so the light bill goes down. Let me get to save money, right? Yeah. Number two, spooky autumn or cozy autumn? I'll take cozy. I'm a romantic. Three, haunted house or Halloween party? Neither. Growing up, I wasn't allowed to um, trick or treat or anything. So I just never got into it. Number four, carved pumpkins or painted pumpkins? Come on, you know, Miss Kay will paint a pumpkin. Add some glitter to it. Painted pumpkins all day. Number five, go apple picking or go on a hayride? Hayride. I've only done it once, but it was real fun. Number six. Pumpkin spice lattes or mulled apple cider. I'll do the apple cider. I really don't have to have either, but I'll take the apple cider. Do you celebrate Halloween? And if you do, what did you dress up for last year? Now I have an interruption. My granddaughter is here. So I'm going to pause for just a I told her I was shooting a video and don't come in until I come out, but she's eating breakfast and she's ready for her drink. Number seven, do you celebrate Halloween? And if you do, what did you dress up for Halloween last year? I don't celebrate Halloween, but I do host like a costume party for girlfriends just to have fun. Um, one year I hosted a girlfriend's party and I called it Fallout Laughing because it was the beginning of fall and I just wanted us to laugh and have a good time. Um, a lot of us had had kind of a rough year, so I wanted us to get together and just enjoy. So two of my girlfriends, they got together and they dressed up as Salt and Pepper and they performed. So, you know, that was one of the groups that was out when we were in high school and it was just so fun. And I dressed up as a nun, which surprised everybody because normally that's not my style. Okay, on to number eight, falling rain or a crackling fireplace? Crackling fireplace. Um, I'm always cold, so 
I like heat year round and I have a heater under my desk at work. My husband is always getting on me because he wants to know who turned the air on. And a fireplace is kind of romantic, so I'll choose the fireplace. Number nine, have you purchased any fall decor yet? Oh yeah. I started back in July. I do something kind of different in the summer. Um, I pull out all my fall decor and I decorate <laughs> my entire house with whatever I have. So that way I can start seeing what I need for the fall. So yeah, I've purchased and probably won't purchase some more. Okay, number 10. What is your favorite fall candle? Honestly, I don't own a fall candle. I use candles, but I just don't have a fall candle. But I do use wallflowers from Bath and Body Works. And this is the pumpkin apple and it smells really good. I have like four or five of these. So I have them all over the house. Um, and they're cheaper. I know they're not as, you know, fall themed um, with the candle feel, but and they last a long time. Favorite autumn themed movie? You've got mail with Tom Hanks and Meg Ryan and Dave Chappelle. You know, it was kind of in the era of we just started emailing, so I like it. Y'all, excuse me one second. <clears throat> Number 12, favorite color to wear in autumn. I like that plum mulberry color. Matches all the lipsticks that I wear. Excuse me. <coughs> 13, get away to see fall leaves or cozy evening in front of the fire pit with marshmallows. I want to see the fall leaves. I like to see all the creations that God has given us. And when those colors change, it's just beautiful to me. Okay, I have a little cough and spill, but I'm back. Best way to spend a rainy day. I will spend a rainy day crafting. I don't like the rain because in our area, we get tornadoes, so the crafting kind of keeps my mind off of the bad weather. Number 15, favorite fall comfort food. Anything but the potato, white potato, sweet potato. My daughter does a really good um, mashed potato casserole with the cheese and bacon. So I like that, you know, potatoes are kind of comforting. Number 16, favorite autumn quote. I kind of like the quote I came up with for this year. Let's get wild in the fall. Number 17, favorite autumn leaf. I'll go with the maple. I really um, didn't have one, but I do decorate with a lot of maple leaves, so. We can just say it's my favorite. Favorite autumn activity. I like to attend homecoming at my old high school. All of the alumni get together at the homecoming football game and we tailgate. Give me one second, Kyler. You may have classes from 1965 up until the class that just graduated. It's just like a huge class reunion. And so um, you could just get to see people um, who you grew up with. And this is something that my class, we look forward to every year because we normally have like the best t-shirts, the best food, and we just enjoy. So um, I'm gonna say um, homecoming at my old high school. 
19. Favorite autumn scent. I like the pumpkin spice. Number 20. Pumpkin pie or sweet potato pie? My mama's sweet potato pie. I still can't perfect it like hers, but it's my favorite. This completes all of the questions in the It's Fall, y'all Q&A, Get to Know Me. Now it's my turn to tag someone. I'm going to tag Angela over at Crafty Nana's 6200. Not only is she my YouTube sister, but she's my blood sister. So let's see, is she gonna choose Mama's Sweet Potato Pie? If she doesn't, I'm telling. She can upload her video at her convenience, no stress. This is just for fun. So tag, you're it. We wanna keep this going. You can tag others to participate. And remember, just to have fun. I wanna thank the Lady Cinnamon and Miss Gigi Faison once again for hosting this fun question and answer. If this is your first time coming to my channel and you love home decor, DIYs, and all the glitter and glam you can get, you should subscribe so we can create together. If you are already a subscriber to my channel, I wanna thank you. I appreciate each and every like, comment, and share that I receive from you. I never knew YouTube could be so fun. Don't forget to go by the Lady Cinnamon's channel and Gigi Faison's channel and see all that they have to offer as well as Angela over at Crafty Nana. Their channels will be listed in my, give me one second, in my description box, I'm sorry, I'm reading. Have a great day and be blessed and I will see you soon.